King Carnelian? What in the... Uh, uh, Who are you? What do you think you're doing? Uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty! Erwin, is that you? What happened? Is everyone safe? You are all right. Thank goodness. Jade's with Eleanor and the Wee One, Your Majesty. They made it safely out of the castle. I see. Good. Very good. I shall send my forces after them, right away. Your Majesty, what do you... <laughs> the bloodline of the Luminary ends here. Today. King Carnelian? Your Majesty? Sire. Forgive me. I was unable to find you. I thank the heavens that you are unhurt. <gasps> K King Erwin? What has happened here? I had no choice. He came at me in a frenzy. Queen Eleanor has absconded with the Luminary, and with my daughter. Surely not. Whatever would possess them to commit such acts? The birth of the child has put them both under great pressure. It has also caused the coming of the monsters, the loss of countless lives. Perhaps the coming of the Luminary does bring darkness in its wake. After all, without him, this tragedy would never have come to pass. Yes, I see now. He is not our savior. He is the harbinger of the night to come. The child of evil, the dark spawn. He must be found and dealt with. The peace of Erdria must not be permitted to collapse. Find him! Leave no stone unturned! Sire. No. He is no harbinger of darkness. He is the luminary. The savior. Someone, please. King Carnelian must be stopped, or the world will be plunged in, into darkness. Eleanor, please, forgive me. I was too weak. Alone. 
which is why I've been drawing out his torture for all these years. One must savor such succulent suffering. But even the most fabulous feasts must come to an end. It is time to move on to the next course. How does your despair compare, I wonder? Hold still while I sample its delights. Give yourself to misery. Let anguish consume you. This is your most painful memory. The darkest, tenderest recess of your soul. It is waiting, biding its time, but it is there, and when it shines forth, it will illuminate the world. Now is that time. You are the luminary. You must conquer the darkness. You must shine. Light is what's happening? You're back with us, laddie. Are you all right? This light, disgusting, it blinds me, it fills my mouth, it tastes of hope. This is the beast responsible for King Erwin's suffering. We must defeat it and lift his majesty's curse. Ha <sighs> ha. Disturb me while I prepare to sample the next delicious morsel of misery. No matter, your screams of agony will surely whet my appetite.
Eyes. I'd know them anywhere. Son, is it really you? It was you who saved me, wasn't it? You're back. You're back to your old self at last. Oh. Eleanor? Our son has freed you. Despair no longer holds you captive. You are free to join me after all these years. I am, my love. I am. await you. Many trials lie ahead, but you must not stray from your path. You must not falter. Let the light of hope, the light inside you, be your guide. Farewell, my darling. I love you so much. Goodbye, my little one. Goodbye, Erwin. I hope both of you find peace at last. <gasps> Honey, your hand! <gasps> the mark. It's glowing again. Your powers, they're back! The Luminary is restored to us, and all thanks to his honored parents.
Victory!
much, huh? You here for a bit of R&R &R like everyone else, eh? R&R? Ha! &R? <laughs> no likely. We've things to be getting on with. Seriously? You ain't an Octagonia to let your hair down? Why else would anyone come here? Everyone's been miserable since it got all dark and that, right? Well, this is where people come to forget all that horrible stuff. To have a bit of fun! I met this girl on the road, as it happens. She said she was headed here too. Cool, she was a looker. Dressed all funny, she was. One of them martial artist types, you know. I was hoping to see her here, if I'm honest. A beautiful martial artist, huh? You don't think it could be... Brav! There he is. I thought he'd never show up. Well, it was nice talking to you. Maybe we'll bump into each other in town again, eh? <sighs> you took your time. Where have you been, you plonker? We got fun to be having. Come on. Here, hold up. Octagonia. It has been a long time. Well, there's no harm in taking a quick look around town, eh? You never know. The lass he was talking about could be Jade. place used to be funner looking? Ugh, and what's with that ugly, ugly statue? So tacky. Welcome to Octagonia. <gasps> A monster. Be on your guard. Oh, come now. There's no need for all that. You're in the new Octagonia now. There's no fighting here anymore, only fun! All those tournaments they used to host, so uncivilized. The arena's a casino now, thanks to Booga, best and most beautiful of the spectral sentinels. Why don't you step inside and chance your arm? It's just upstairs. Who knows? It might be your lucky day! A casino run by monsters, eh? It all sounds a wee bit fishy to me. Still, we'd better go and take a look. Jade might be inside. Thank you. 
many of your kind here. Well, don't worry. We'll look after you. If you'll just follow me. <laughs> Humans for ya! <laughs> More lambs to the slaughter, eh? Uh, huh? huh? Can it really be? Princess? Henry? What's a man as dull as you doing in a place as lively as this, hmm? I suppose even fine, upstanding knights of the realm need a cheap thrill every now and again, eh? Well, are you ready to play? But, but, you... I... What's the matter, Henny Wenny? Cat got your tongue? Is the king's little lapdog scared of a bit of fun? I've been pining for a puppy as it happens. Maybe I'll choose you, if you sit up and beg like a good boy. Um... Jade, listen to yourself, lassie. What's happened to you? Stop all this nonsense and come with us, will you? In case you've forgotten, Mordigan's still out there. We need you. Oh, be quiet, you doddery old fool. You're ruining the mood. Wow, Mordigan's still out there. Well, he can stay out there for all I care. I'm Boogers now. He's the only one that matters to me. My heart, my soul, my body. They're all his. Why in the world would I want to join your band of do-gooders? I'm happy here. Happy. For the first time in my life. You are a princess of Heliodor. You will behave like one. This den of iniquity is no place for a lady. You are coming with us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going nowhere, and you can keep your hands to yourself. What would you know about ladies, anyway? Hmm? Tell you what, why don't I give you a crash course? My foot crashing into your face. <laughs> Move on!
socks up. Guys, come on now, lassie. That's enough foolishness. Come along with us, will you? Oh dear. Well, isn't this awkward? You appear to have nobbled my number one croupier. I suspect that means you don't know who you're dealing with. Let me introduce myself. I am Booga, Spectral Sentinel, the Raker of Hearts, Smasher of Heads. Heard of him, right? <gasps> oh, he's the one who turned Octagonia into such a silly spectacle. <gasps> Honey, you have no taste. <laughs> oh, Jade, my pretty little kitty cat. Look what the nasty people did to you. <laughs> King Booga will punish them. You'll see. Step away from the princess, fiend! She is coming with us. You've come to steal away my pretty, have you? No, no, no! That just won't do! Not after I went to all the trouble of putting her under my spell. Do you think it was easy turning such a lovely girl into a horrible monster? You can turn humans into monsters? D does that mean all the others are they? <laughs> of course! Jade wasn't my first, you know. All my lovely girls used to be human, and the boys too. Nothing like making a monster out of a smug human who thinks they've beaten the house. That soon wipes the smile off their faces, let me tell you. Now listen here, you. Jade's coming with us. You'll be using her for no more of your nefarious nonsense. <sighs> 
Oh dear, I'm afraid my casino has a zero tolerance policy towards troublemakers. I would throw you out, but I'd rather crush you to a pulp.
Well, since you're clearly into that sort of thing, I'll be happy to give you a repeat performance. <sighs> Yet. 
take heart! Your feet now.
I don't feel right. My spell... No! It's weakening. <laughs> I am Booga, brightest and most beautiful of the spectral <laughs> sentinels. You. What? <laughs> I remember everything, in fact. Have your wicked way with me, would you? Princess, you... you're... Looks like there's still a little of the old monster in me. Something tells me it's going to come in handy. I'm so sorry. You must have been so worried about me. Ah, didn't he give us a second thought, lassie? You're safe and sound now. That's the important thing. Princess, my behavior was unforgivable. 
I do not ask for forgiveness. I ask only that you understand that all I do, I do that the Lord of Shadows might be defeated. What kind of way to say hello is that, Henny Wenny? Less of the nightly nonsense. We'll have to spank you. Oh, I, uh... Oh, I'm only joking. <laughs> Thanks for always being there, Hendrik. I mean that. And as for you, something's changed since I last saw you. You seem tougher. Here, I think you'd better have this. I found it on my travels, and I've been trying to track you down to give it to you ever since. You already know how it works. Maybe one of those columns of light out at sea will open up some new horizons. Right, we've got more friends to find, and an evil overlord to beat. Don't you think we'd better get going? Thank <laughs> you. 